That's going to do something about our missing people. I assure you, we don't... Orcs to the south, mercenaries camped outside by the lake, and now people are missing. I'm not sure how much more we can take. You don't have the half of it. It's the damn Lodos Plague. People are scared. Many have already fled Narsis to avoid getting sick. Of course, that's not what the remaining villagers believe. They think their families were stolen in the middle of the night. I've heard everything from a plot by the house leaders to elf-eating Bane King roaming the countryside. The Kin House is looking into it. Speak to whoever you want. The Kin House is more concerned with the coming plague than searching for people who probably just ran away. But I'm sure a counselor will hear you out. I'm not paid to think about this. That's a luxury for someone of higher rank than me. I'll admit something seems off kilter. If only the house councillors would see it that way. I told you. We're leaving this forsaken place. I'd rather... Wait. You're not my husband. What do you want? Narsus isn't safe, stranger. Not that House Lalu cares. Do the guards search for our missing people? No, because the house councillors don't tell them to. I'm not going to become a victim. That's why I'm leaving. No one does anything in Narsis if the Kin House doesn't command it. It's that large building over there. You can't miss it. Be careful, outsider. They might decide you're sick. Plague this, plague that. It's their only concern lately. How do you fight something you can't see? It isn't fair. I can't cut the throat of the plague. I can't smash its bones. I can only wait until it fills me with its blackness and takes my life bit by bit. Me? No, not yet. I wait for the plague to find me. That's all we can do, isn't it? The house leaders debate how to keep the plague out of Narsus, how to protect us. Why do they even bother? They try, but the solution eludes them. We'll slowly fade away, one by one, as the plague takes us all. Gates can't stop it. We can't lock it out. Enjoy your last days, outsider. For the plague takes us all in the end. I don't suppose you're here to buy a weapon. No, you probably just want me to fix another wagon wheel or something. Everyone just wants to get out of here. Look around. Narsus is practically deserted. The plague, the curse, whatever you want to call it, it's driving everyone away. Or maybe that crazy story the villagers chatter on about is true. I guess anything's possible. I think the people are scared, and they should be. The Lodos Plague rushes onward, and Narsus is directly in its path. If there's any truth to the other rumors, then I'm sure the house councillors will deal with it. I'm sorry you had to witness that. My friend shows great concern for Narsis, sometimes greater than my own. What can I do for you? You'd think the entire town had disappeared the way everyone carries on. People are missing, but Giron has guards looking into the matter. For all we know, they fled to avoid the Lotus Plague. Very little. No one has actually seen any of these people leave Narsis. And we don't have enough guards to follow up on every lead. I usually don't hire mercenaries, but these are desperate times. If you can prove these claims aren't just fearful delusions, report back to me immediately. You'll be rewarded. Have you seen my damned apprentice? The boy's later than usual today. With my luck, he's probably gone off and gotten the plague. I wouldn't worry about it. I whipped him for messing up our shipments, and he's probably off sulking. The boy claims it wasn't his fault that we received the wrong crates. Like I believe that. He needs to pay better attention. They're stacked on the other side of the shed. Damn kids broke into them during the night, took whatever was in them, and ran. If you want to pick through the broken crates, be my guest. Looking into matters that don't concern you, outsider.
could he be so stupid? I told him where to deliver the shipment, but he thinks he knows everything. That's why things get messed up. My apologies, just talking to myself, don't mind me. Nothing at all, don't mind me. Just a servant here. What's it to you, anyway? Why are you in my master's house? He's an important person in Narsis. A writer. Writes all day, writes all night. But don't touch his journal. He can get frightfully angry. How would I know? I, I sweep, I dust. I, I don't read. The master would never let me look in his journal. His room upstairs is off limits. I stay down here, cleaning, just as my wife. Staying out of trouble. Some of my family traveled to the Cirque to seek a cure. Where's my husband? Bebebek's beard, if he's drunk and passed out somewhere, I'll leave without him. That no good, useless piece of Kwama cattle. Oh, hello. You haven't seen my husband around, have you? Everyone knows my husband. <laughs> Evis, if he hasn't borrowed something from you or finished off your Ash Lake Ale, then you're not trying very hard. He was supposed to be back hours ago. That lazy lout is late. He ships our goods. He mentioned something about a botched delivery that he had to deal with. You know what he's probably dealing with. His thirst for ale. That would be a big help. I'm sure he's sleeping it off in one of the nearby houses. If you find an elf that smells of piss and ale, that's Evis. Tell him to hurry up or he's walking to Mournhold. I have no intention of letting an amateur screw up my investigation. Turn around and walk away. Now, you're interrupting my interrogation, that's what. And just as I was about to get to my favorite part, I have no quarrel with you. Not yet. So go away. Why is everyone in this town so damned stubborn? I'm armed to the teeth and dangerous as all get out, and you're not scared? Not even a little? Fine. You're lucky I don't feel like killing you today. I thought you will. Never mind. I'll do this another way. Know this, however. We've tracked shipments of the Lodos Plague into Narsis. I don't know what happened after they got here. Narsis is in danger. Stay out of my way. You've been warned. Um, could I have that letter back? I'd really appreciate it. I hope you're here to tell me that my people are just imagining things and everything is fine. What's this? Notes? A journal attacked? Slow down. Hmm. I've never heard of Vox. And the thought of someone smuggling Lotus Plague into Narsis frightens me greatly. But where are the missing people? This news is very disturbing. I'm at a loss. People disappear into thin air and someone brought a plague into Narsis? That terrifies me. How could they even accomplish this without our notice? I need to seal the city. No one gets in or out. I won't let any more of our people vanish. Will you perform one more task for us? To facilitate your mission, the guards have been informed that you may come and go as you please. Find Giron Sadri. He's upstairs. He needs to know what you discovered. Do whatever he asks. I need to speak to the guards and prepare to seal Narsis. Half of Narsis must vanish, and plague must threaten the city before Rawdon comes to his senses? And it takes an outsider to make him understand. Perhaps my friend isn't fit to lead anymore. Of course he did. Rawdon hasn't been able to make a decision on his own in years. At least he's finally doing the right thing. As for you, I have something you can do. 
The Moorborn are obviously involved. Any fool can see that. With the city sealed, all of the guards will be busy. However, you don't have those responsibilities. I suggest you slice a path through their camps by the lake. Look for anything that will tell us the location of the Lodos Plague. Return when you find something. Do you? Before you ask, yes, I've been following you. No, I have nothing to do with the missing people or the plague, and no, I'm not here to fight you. Ah, that's out of the way. Feel better? Now let's talk about why Giron wants you dead. Of course he did. Sending an overconfident outsider into camps full of Moorborn certainly sounds like a day at the fair. And if they killed you, you'd never find out that he brought the plague to Narsus, would you? I've been watching Narsus for weeks. We even have an agent inside the Kin House. Anything that enters or leaves Narsus is trapped, and those broken crates had Giron's name written all over them. The question is, why? What have you discovered? This doesn't look good. There must be a reason why Geron wanted Narsa sealed and why he wanted you dead. Get back there and find out. The organization I belong to does two things. Finds targets and eliminates targets. My target happens to be connected to the Lodos Plague. Our goals overlap. That's not your concern. Just remember what I told you. We're on the same side. And don't let yourself kill Kiro. Narsa needs you. Sorry. We don't know each other well enough to get that personal just yet. Trust me, though. We both want to stop the Morborn. Not your concern. Just... Ralden isn't here. He and Giron left some time ago. And Giron's connection to the Morborn makes me a little concerned. Let's just say I'm well informed. I've suspected the connection for a while, and his abduction of the counselor confirms it. My associate and I tend to avoid situations not covered by our contracts. Still, we might be able to assist one another. I don't know. I only know what the reports tell me. Giron probably took Ralden somewhere secluded, far from prying eyes. Narsis is sealed. Villagers are missing. Crates of Lodos Plague arrive in the night. How you discover the plague intensifies when it festers inside a corpse. Makes you wonder about Giron's plan, doesn't it? Reports tell me that a group of villagers have decided to take matters into their own hands. I don't condone their actions, but they might have information. Find the Argonian called Slips Through Fingers. She can lead you to them. I have a feeling she's going to want your help. Tales of your exploits already spread through Narsis. Find the Argonian, and I'd wager that before you say a word, she asks you to meet with her companions. We drop things when I'm in her. Keep your voice down and act like you're helping me. I can't go into details, not here, but I know you've been trying to find the missing people for House Lalu. Don't ask questions, just listen. We know where our people are being held, including Counselor Ralden. Follow the clues in the pack. I'll see you at the meeting place. Not here. Just look in the pack.
expects us to believe that our friends and family left Narcissus without saying... You found us. I apologize for my earlier abruptness. We heard you confirm that our people were taken. We're tired of waiting for House Lalu to act. We know where our people are being held. But because of the lockdown, we can't go get them. I watched the Malborn abduct my egg sister. I saw where they took her. I saw Counselor Walden and Advisor Giron go to the same place. You have to help us. I doubt the guards will try to restrain you. You can come and go as you please. Speak to Madras. Let him tell you our plan. You must help us. I need my egg sister back. You must be the one Slips told us about. She said an outsider was hired to find our people. It's a strange thing for an outsider to do, even for Hlalu Gold. What are you really up to? So that's it. Hlalu's leader disappears and they finally decide to take action. I don't give a damn about Counselor Ralden. I just want our people back. Act. We'll get weapons, ignore the lockdown and rescue our people. If anyone tries to stop us, we'll cut them down. Are you going to help us? I don't want to fight them. They have their orders. But they're wasting time. Every second that passes is another second our people remain in danger. Sometimes you have to resort to drastic measures to save the ones we care about. I know this isn't an easy decision, especially for someone who has no stake in this. But I have to know if you're going to help us. We could use someone with your skills. We're going to rescue our families, or die trying. I don't trust you, outsider. We'll deal with this ourselves. Leave us. Run back to your housemasters and stay out of our way. If you get taken by the Malborn, don't come to us for help. I'm sure House Lalu will save you. How did you get in there? Madras doesn't let just anyone attend his secret meetings. Wait, you're the outsider working for Councillor Ralden. Please tell me you haven't bought into Madras's foolishness. I've been passing information to him. My mother vanished, but I have my orders. So, I've been hoping Madras and his people would find something I could take to the house leaders. What? Madras is going to get those people killed. They're farmers and peasants, not soldiers. I can't let them do this. We need to find the missing villagers and get them to safety before Marjus leads this group to its doom. I'll find out where Marjus thinks they are. But first, you have to help me slow Marjus down. Cause a distraction, something that will slow them down and give you enough time to find our missing people. Everyone's on edge because of the Lodos plague. We can use that. You know what people think causes the plague? Rats. See the rats running around the village? Harmless, but people are afraid of them. Take this bag, grab as many rats as you can, bring them back here and release them at the door. That should scatter Marjus's group for a while. You help me disrupt this meeting and save these people's lives, and I'll find out what Marjus knows. Catch those rats and bring them back here. There's no time to waste. The little swits are quick. If you get too close, they'll run away from you. So grab them, stand as far back as you can. That way you'll catch them by surprise. Out of my way! Don't let them bite you! Looks like the rats are moving in. I appreciate your help in this. Now no one will get hurt. Those people just want to see their friends and families again. But I don't want them to get hurt. Calling the guards will just make the situation worse. I got the information from my contact in the group. Report back to the Kin House. I'll meet you there. I'm going to retrieve a key that you'll need. Keep this quiet, alright?
Any sign of Diron or Raldan? That's good news. I also heard from my associate, Nari Uvirian. We may have finally gotten a few breaks in this sordid city. Nariu told me you found a note at the Moorborn camp. That might be a link to the creator of the Lodos Plague. This drastically changes our stance on the situation here. I care only about a name and a location. Such information brings me closer to fulfilling my current contract. Because of this, I've decided to offer some assistance. I'll gather the House Halalu guards and follow you. Whatever you find, the guard will be there to back you up. Now go. Find your ally and save the counselor. I'll catch up with you soon. I'll gather the guards and follow in your path. Now go. Find your ally and let's finish this. I've been here for weeks, playing the political games common to all dark elf kin houses. I've decided I hate such games. But you'd be surprised what you can learn if you just stand back and listen. Giron isn't our target. We're after the one who created the Lodos Plague. I decided to reach out to you and provide a modicum of aid. Your actions may lead me to the one I seek. Right now, I'm your very best friend. Work with me, and we'll make sure Narciss isn't destroyed by the Maulborn. I've got the key and the location you seek, as promised. Our plan might have worked a little too well. You can still hear screams coming out of Madras's house. Ruins beneath Narsis. You can find the entrance to the west. Old door. Looks out of place against the rocks. Doors locked to keep people out of the ruins. Guess that didn't work out. Don't thank me. You're the one rushing into the fire. I should be thanking you. Just be careful down there. If what Madras said is true, you're going to run into a lot of opposition. Also, I destroy you. Nothing will stand in Fox's way. Giron betrayed me. He killed our people and put Lotus Plague into their bodies. Said it made it more potent. He needed a large supply of potential corpses. That's why he wanted Narsis locked down. It's too late for me. But you must listen. Don't let anyone drink the water. The lake must be cleansed. And I need to tell you about Vox. She's their leader. Narsis is only the beginning. They're making Lotus Plague in the gorge. They're going to spread it to... to... more. Good to see you made it. Still alive, I see. I suppose that justifies Nariu's confidence in you. Did you find them? How's Ralden? Are they inside? I see. Ralden was a good man who cared for his people. He should be remembered that way. The guards are dealing with the Moorborn in the ruins. What happened in there? So that's why he wanted Narsis locked down. He wanted a ready supply of plague carriers. House Tlalu will make sure no one drinks from the lake until it's cleansed. Narsis is safe, at least for now. We'll get these people to the healers. You should get some rest. I fear things are about to get more complicated. The Maulborn are more dangerous than we thought. I'm sure your help will be needed again. We'll make sure these people receive care. When you have a moment, return to Narsis and speak to Nariu. She has a lead on the name you uncovered. I'll join you as soon as I can. Yes, I had Nariu investigate the evidence you retrieved from the Moorborn camp. She discovered something she wants to share. Find her back in town.